You'll have 10 seconds for each of the optical illusions. Your task will be to read the hidden number. You'll go from the easiest to the hardest riddles. Start off with an easy one for warm-up. Told you, it's 784. Moving on. I hope you were able to see the number 5346 here. Level up. How about this one? The correct answer is 725. And another one. Yes, it's 786. Now, only 5% of people can read the next three numbers. Want to give it a go? If your answer is 6012, it's correct. And here's another tricky one. It's 182. And if you saw it, you must have eagle vision. Told you it won't be easy, but try this one. The correct answer is 3708. Let's see how you handle some black and white illusions. And the first one is hiding the number 476. There you go. If that was too simple, how about this one? I hope you guessed it was 86347. And now let's test your eyes with some hidden words. You still have 10 seconds for each of them. I'm sure you figured out it's the word never. Can you read what this picture says? I can't sleep. How sad. This one is hiding the name of some month. You have to think outside the box to read it. Feel free to pause the video if you need more time. Well, the secret was to split it in half. Then you can see it's July. How about this one? It's the word run hiding in the back. Another one for you. Hope you found the gold. Here comes a tricky one. It takes some brain power to see its brain. Another one in this category. It's only getting more complicated. If you read the word music between the lines, you must be a genius. Now let's see if you can decipher these secret messages. I give you 10 seconds for this one.
Well, if someone says it's just a bunch of letters without meaning, you can easily prove them wrong. What do you see here? The power of imagination makes us infinite. Couldn't agree more. Here's another one. I hope you always desire to learn something useful. You deserve some dessert for all that mental activity. Here's just one cupcake among all those ice cream cones. Try to find it. There it is. Yum. Get a tomato to go. I can only see a bunch of apples, but maybe you'll be luckier here. Found it! There's a butterfly hiding somewhere among those flowers. Do you see it? Fantastic! It's right there! Can you find the one and only pineapple in this image? Great job! One of these colorful leaves is in fact a mushroom. Can you spot it? Well done! How about a safari to give your eyes another test? Do you see anyone hiding in these leaves? Yep, it's a chameleon. And those guys know how to blend with the surroundings. There must be a groundhog hiding somewhere in the rocks. Find it in 10 seconds. Wow, that was neat. One coyote won't do you much harm, but if it brings some friends, Better make sure this area is coyote free. Start looking for a different picnic spot. One of those guys is right here. Watch where you step. I hear there are snakes on the ground. Found one. Better be careful. I don't see anyone roaming in this territory. Let's see if you have sharper eyes. What a beautiful gazelle. Did you manage to find it? The next illusion was created back in 1860. It shows how your brain perceives depth and shapes. So, do you think the black line lines up with the blue one? If you answered yes, you're wrong. In fact, the black line stems from the red line. Now, take a look at these illusions and remember what you see first. It can tell a lot about your personality. If it looks like a mountain to you, you're a down-to-earth person. You're persistent, reliable, and like to plan things. Overcoming obstacles makes you feel really happy. You appreciate stability and don't like to take risks. If you saw the upside-down wolf first, you're a natural leader. 
You keep your emotions under control even in the most stressful situations. Others admire and respect you for that. Remember, it's okay to ask for help sometimes if you need it. How about this one? If lips caught your eye first, you're realistic and always take things the way they are. You don't look for hidden meaning in what happens to you and what others say to you. It helps you get along with people well. If you notice the trees first, you're an ambitious person and a perfectionist to the core. You're never happy with just okay and will always strive to be number one and make yourself and others happy. In the case the first thing you saw was the roots, you're an extremely progressive person. You love trying all the new technology and styles. You never settle and always try to make your life better and more exciting. Here comes the next one. If it looks like a parrot to you, you're the soul of any party. You like to be the center of attention, wear something bright, talk loudly, and laugh your heart out. You have plenty of friends who love that about you. If you see a girl in a beautiful long dress, you must be the mysterious artsy type. You prefer to observe others being active and loud and get inspiration for your work. You notice little details and remember them to later put them on your canvas or paper. You have 10 seconds to decide what you see in this illusion here. If it's clearly an image of an elephant and a giraffe, you're a reliable and hardworking person. You feel responsible for yourself and your work and don't like to let others down. People appreciate you for that and share their secrets with you. If you saw some rabbits between the trees, you're not as simple as you might seem. You always think before you say or do something. You have a strategy for every life situation. It's important to you to be accepted and loved by others, so you do a lot to please them. New illusion, same task. If you see just two horses crossing a waterfall, you're an adventurous person. When someone offers trying something new or going to a new place, you're always up for it. You realize you might not like it in the end, but you'd rather try it and be sad than regret not going. In case you noticed several faces first, you always see the big picture and can find the right decision quickly. You know what you want and how to get there and never reconsider your own choices. These qualities will take you far in your career. Moving on. What a beautiful landscape, but is it hiding something? If all you see here is some sea and rocks, you're a calm and balanced person. Sometimes you're in a bad mood, but you always look on the bright side of life and move on. If you also noticed some animals drawn on the rocks, you have a great eye for detail. You always listen to both parties in a conflict before taking sides. You like doing research and drawing logical conclusions. All right, what does this one say to you? In case you're positive it's a portrait of a young girl, you're an extrovert and can't survive a day without people. You're active on social media and enjoy going to social events where you can make even more friends. If you see some horses and birds, you're more of an introvert. You love being alone outside. You have some great friends, but you appreciate your personal space. Those who see the face and the horses at once, you've got the best of both worlds. You feel comfortable at a party with a few hundred new people around and alone reading a book. What can you say about this illusion? Those who see a face of a woman, you're realistic and pretty content with your life. 
You don't expect too much from others and are ready to stand your ground if you have to. If you see a saxophone player, you often prefer your imaginary world to the real one. In your dreams, you have turned your favorite hobby into a career. Try doing that in real life. What are your thoughts on this one? If it's clearly an older man to you, you've always been wiser and more reasonable than others your age. That's why people often ask you for advice, and you enjoy helping them out. If you see a young girl and an older man in the arch, you'll always be a child at heart. Your family means the world to you, and you always ask them for advice and protection. Get ready for a new set of absolutely amazing optical illusions. Concentrate hard and don't let them trick you. Number 1. Look at these circles attentively and you'll notice they're rotating. But that's just an illusion. The circles are completely still. Number 2. Which is bigger, the hat's height or its width? They're absolutely the same. Your eyes are playing tricks on you. Number three, which tower is leaning more? Ha, look at that, they're the same. Even though one tower seems to be lopsided when placed next to a copy of itself, this is called the leaning tower illusion. Number four, how many colors do you see in this image? However many you might see, in reality, there are only three. Number five, the patterns in this picture seem to be moving. But once you focus on one of the ovals, the whole image becomes still. Number six, what do you see in this picture? A moving star? Well, the star part is correct, but in reality, it's a static image. Once again, if you concentrate on any of its parts, the picture will stop moving. Number seven. It seems as if there are three cylinders in this image and they're all rotating. But you know what to do. Stare at the center of the picture and all the movement will stop. Number eight, which pencil is longer? They are of the same length. Number nine, can you find three animals in this picture? Three bunnies are hiding in the tree branches. Number 10, look at this rotating thingy. There's no doubt it's a 3D image, but in reality, it's just a set of rotating figures that creates such a three-dimensional effect. Number 11. Look at the screen and move your head forward and backward while focusing on the center of the image. When you come closer, the lines will seem to rotate counterclockwise. As soon as you start to move away from the image, the lines will rotate clockwise. Number 12. There is something hidden in this grid. Can you figure out what it is? If you can't spot it, try to shake your head, move further from the screen, or screw up your eyes. And just in case it hasn't helped either, let me make the grid less bright. Here we go. A lovely kitty. Number 14. Can you figure out which word is hidden here? That's bedside. Number 15. Look at this image and say which string is tied to the banana.
I was almost sure it was string number two, but in fact, that's the third one. Number 16. Which word is brighter? If you remove the grid, it'll become obvious that both words are of the same color. Number 17. Each horizontal band seems to be lighter in the middle and darker near the boundaries. But in reality, all of them are of a uniform shade. Number 18. Which line is longer, A or B? They're both of the same length. This illusion is created because your mind perceives this image in 3D space. That's why your brain tells you that the line which is closer to you must be shorter than the more distant one. Number 19. Are the woman's eyes of the same color? In fact, they are. You can make sure of it by comparing the color of her eyes and the hair accessory. Number 20. At first sight, it's just a red fan rotating over a bright green background. But try to concentrate on the black dot in the middle. You'll notice that the green under the fan is brighter than that of the surrounding ring. And the fan blades are actually redder than the central disc. Number 21. These two discs are pulsating, changing between dark and light. But are they doing it at the same time? Keep watching, and you'll see that it depends on the background. When it's light, the discs pulsate in sync. But when one part of the background is light and the other is dark, the discs seem to pulse not simultaneously. Number 22. Which word is hidden in this image? That's the word quality. Number 23. Which creature has a longer mouth, yellow or green? Their mouths are of the same length. Number 24. How about this picture? Which word does it hide? High five if you spotted the word quite. Number 25. That's how a set of simple straight lines can trick your brain. The square made up of vertical lines looks wider and shorter than the one formed of horizontal lines. Number 26. Look at this pyramid made of elongated diamonds. Are these diamonds darker at the top or at the bottom of the pyramid? All diamonds are identical, even though it surely doesn't look like that. But once we start moving around them, this way, and comparing them with one another, it becomes obvious. Number 27. Find three animals hidden in this image. Right you are. There are three foxes over there in the tree. Number 28. Look at the wheel moving behind the red picket fence. Its spokes seem to be bent at the bottom. There's nothing wrong with the wheel, and the spokes are perfectly straight. Want to make sure? Look, the fence is becoming transparent. Here you go. Number 29. Now, this wheel seems to be rotating clockwise, and the spokes are moving counterclockwise. But if you look at one of the spokes attentively, you'll notice it's actually staying in one place. Or rather, it makes a tiny shift forward and then returns to its place. Number 30. Which word is hidden in this image? It's feather. Number 31. What do you see in this picture? There's no definite answer here. Some people notice footprints, others, five bowling pins. Number 32. How about this picture? Are those three pairs of alternating grooves and ridges? Or maybe you see three shiny oval tubes.
The main trick is that the right side of the image looks like a folded surface and the left resembles the tubes. Number 33. Which word do you see here? It's the word change. Number 34. Look at the blue lines. They seem to be moving in pairs. And how about now? They suddenly form an outline of a diamond. Number 35. These wooden railroad tracks seem to be different in size. The lower one looks larger than the one at the top, but if we switch them, it becomes obvious that they're identical in size. Number 36. Do these horizontal lines seem parallel to you? And what if I tell you they are? And what you see is just an illusion. Number 37. Try to figure out which line is longer here. If your answer is, come on, I know they're of the same length. You're absolutely right. Number 38. Can you see anything unusual in this picture? There's a Dalmatian hiding here. Number 39. There seems to be a bulge in the middle of this checkerboard. But in reality, this checkerboard is regular, and each of its checks is perfectly square. You'll see it once we remove the tiny black and white ticks. Number 40. The blue horizontal stripes in this picture can't be parallel, right? But if we remove all the additional elements, it'll become apparent that the lines are not oblique. 